For any cables with multiple branches, circuit elements, and possibly faults, you can imagine there could be a lot of reflections, and a lot of reflections to keep track of. There is something we can do to help us keep track of all the different reflections. Do you have some ideas of what we could do? Maybe you thought that keeping track of the leading edge of the propagating signal everywhere on the line would help. This is something we can do with what's called a bounce diagram. Bounce diagrams are useful for keeping track of the leading edge of all the different propagating signals. They are also helpful for predicting how the voltage and current will change over time at any particular point on the transmission line. Since we typically draw the transmission line as being straight along the z-axis, if we keep track of the leading edge of the signals on this straight axis, the, signal will all start, the signals will all start to overlap each other, and it will be hard to distinguish between the different signals, like V1+, plus, V1-, minus, V2+, plus, and so forth, overlapping each other. Can you think of something we can do to alleviate this problem?